Good morning, it's Monday and the plan today is make products, make orders. Uh, that sale went wild, <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Um, yeah, so thank you very much for your support. The, uh, the sale went wild on Friday night, it went live to the Brotherhood on Friday evening at 6pm and then my phone was just going ding, 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 ding with orders and then same again on Saturday. So... There's well over, well, this, I'm not saying there's well over, there is over 100 orders sitting there that I need to go through and uh, get done. So I need to make them, get them packaged up and ready for the postie. That is not likely to happen today for them all. Um, I'm going to spend the time making the products and then hopefully make what I can, eh, get out what I can get out before the postie comes. And then I'll fulfill the rest this afternoon, maybe have to do some tomorrow morning and then get them all out uh, tomorrow. So... Yeah, it's just the nature of it. I'm a one-man business, and uh, there was way more orders than I was expecting. So, thank you very much for your support. That's another milestone hit. Over 100 orders in 24 hours. So, thank you very much for your support. It means a lot to me. Right, um, what else? Oh, the weekend, uh, got more of the tattoo done. We are getting a look at the detail on that, man. That's incredible. Uh, I can't twist my whole arm, but yeah. Ellie McCary up at Sacred Dagger Tattoo uh, was working on me. Uh, got another full day session, we reckon. There's not a full day in it, so hopefully get that done maybe the end of, end of October, maybe middle of October, something like that, and get finished. So, we're getting there. So, yeah, I've got the tattoo bam on there just now. Um, the Brobier tattoo bam is working well. Always put on from the fresh, fresh tattoo, and uh, it helps the healing process as well. So, all good. Uh, also, not at the gym today. I need to get in the lab. Um, the gym is one of my non-negotiables, however, I've got a new tattoo, uh, I don't want to run sweat through it, and I want to get these orders done as quick as possible. So, no gym today, no gym on Wednesday, probably no gym on Friday either, just to let this, this tattoo heal, and then back at it next week. Um, and then family time at the weekend as well, so it was good, just chilling out with family, which was really nice. However... I am going to go into the lab now, get started on these orders, we'll see how we go, and uh, as always, thanks for your support, I will see you in a little bit, see ya. Oh, hello! <laughs> this is Monday done. Been a busy one. Been a busy one. Uh, I just went for this music. Come on, loud as well. There was a lot of orders there. They ended up being about 115, maybe 100. Yeah, 114, 113, something like that. Um, ah, Morgan Wade there. Been listening to Morgan Wade. <laughs> um, yeah, busy day. So that's pretty much what I've been doing all day is making the products uh, here. That's just the oils, uh, and here is the shampoos ready to be uh, filled. So, yeah, there's a lot of products there. Um, they're all made, uh, and I got about half the orders done. I got about 50 odd orders done. So, uh, finish them tomorrow, and uh, they'll all be away tomorrow. So, yeah, not too bad. I thought I was going to, I didn't think I would get as much done today, but yeah, it went all right. It went all right. So, um, sorry, my head's fried, man. I've just been jumping about the lab. Um, I'll be back in tomorrow, obviously, finishing the orders and stuff. As you see, the orders that got shown today, that'll be all the orders. I'm just chucking them in the Monday section, but you know that they dragged over to, to Tuesday. But when I edit this on Friday, I'll chuck them all on Monday, just for it to make sense with the, the times. Um, also, got a very cool message uh, at the weekend from Jesse from Killswitch Engage. Check this out. Greetings, Brotherhood. This is Jesse Leach from Killswitch Engage. I just put the uh, Grand Erickson 1918 beard oil in, feeling pretty spicy, feeling pretty good. Uh, supporting Iron Maiden today on stage here in Australia. Incredible stuff and uh, rocking the gear. 
Just wanted to say what's up to everybody there in the community. I really support what you guys are doing. I love it. It's beautiful. You got each other's back. That's what it's all about. So all hails to you guys and stay bra. All right. So yeah, how awesome is that? It's uh, <laughs> Jesse from Kill Switch Engage enjoying bra beard products on tour with Iron Maiden, which is just just awesome. Which is amazing. Um, so yeah, chuff for that. Chuff for that. Um, plan tomorrow is it's Elaine's birthday tomorrow, so um, <laughs> I feel a bit bad that I'm going to be working all day, but I am. Um, Elaine's birthday. I'll like chill out for an hour or two in the morning, maybe. Um, start an hour later or something and then get in, get orders done, do the Tuesday night check-in because we've missed it for two weeks. Um, again, Elaine had the, the issue with her teeth, uh, getting her wisdom teeth out, so um, she says to do the Tuesday night check-in tomorrow and then kind of have birthday celebrations afterwards. So that's what we're going to do. And then Wednesday, back in the lab um, and back filming. So yeah, it's all gone. Right, I'm going to boost, head home, chill with the family and I will see you on Wednesday. Catch you later. Good morning, it's Wednesday and I completely forgot to do the intro in the van. Uh, I was rushing about <laughs> rushing about, and uh, this morning I totally forgot. I was away getting fuel, lunch, that kind of stuff and uh, yeah, totally forgot to do the intro. So here we are, it's Wednesday and the plan today is uh, get stuff done for Halloween. Uh, I managed to clear all the orders yesterday as well. So all the, the sale orders and the regular orders are away. Um, there's some to get done this morning, and then uh, I've got some stuff to work on for Halloween. I'll see if I, let's see, I don't want to give too much away, right? Here's a little sneak peek. A little sneak peek of what's coming. This is the back of the label. I don't want to give you the front yet. But uh, yeah, working on that, so that's pretty cool. So that'll be coming out um, the last week in September for pre-order, and then it'll get launched in October. And uh, also we've got Anniversary 24 coming as well. It's an anniversary oil that comes out every year, but I change it every year. It's a different recipe every year. But yeah, Anniversary 24 is coming as well. So there's a lot to work on. Um, yeah, a lot to work on. Right, I'm going to boost, get started, and I will see you in a little bit. See ya. Hello, how's it going? That is Wednesday done. Uh, it's been a good day again. There was a lot of orders there, so they are away now. Uh, got a lot of social media stuff done. Um, got some photography done for the new Halloween stuff. Although I'm not entirely happy with it, I might need to change it. <laughs> um, yeah, spent ages working on it, and when I got to the end result, I was just like, you know what, it just feels a bit crap. So, yeah, I think I'm going to redo that. Um, probably next week, probably next week now, um, by the time I get that done. Um, and then customer review of the week, got that done as well. Uh, some social media posts, there's a new Instagram campaign just went out just now. So yeah, productive day. There was uh, not too much to show, but yeah, there was a lot got done, a lot got done. Um, yeah. Right, I'm going to head home, chill with the family, and I will see you on Friday. Part of me, um, yeah, back in the, uh, back in the lab tomorrow, but back filming on Friday. I'm still, I'm not sure if I'm going to go to the gym or not yet. Tattoo's still healing, it's lubed up with the, the tattoo, um, aftercare cream, and yeah, the bra, it's a bra uh, tattoo balm, that's what I've got on it for healing, and it's getting to the stage where it's starting to peel a wee bit now, so um, yeah, I'm not sure I want to go to the, the gym and aggravate it against the benches and stuff, you know. So I'll make the decision near the time. So Friday morning, might start in the gym. Probably won't. Uh, might leave it till, <laughs> leave it till next week. <laughs> right, I'm gonna boost. Thanks for watching. I will see you on Friday. Catch you later. Good morning, it's Friday, and the plan today is get into the lab, get orders done, and then get the vlog done. Uh, there's a couple of other things I need to get done as well. Um, so that's kind of it for, the, for today. That's the plan for today, really. Um, working on the stuff for Halloween. Uh, all the things are here apart from one item which should be here next week and then I can start getting the photos done for it and then getting the website and stuff ready for pre-order at the end of uh, September 
So I think 26th of September, I think the pre-order will open and it'll run until the kind of 1st of August, eh, 1st of October, sorry, and then, yeah. So, as I said before, I think it was, was it last week I shared, there's a, a t-shirt coming, um, and, and yes, uh, yeah, on Wednesday I shared uh, a little sneak down the oil that I'm doing, so... Yeah, there's a lot happening for Halloween, and then obviously we've got Anniversary 24 coming as well. Uh, the Beard Oil, that'll come out in October, and um, possibly a new winter hat. I say possibly, there is definitely a new winter hat happening. Um, I'm hoping it's going to be ready for October. If not, it'll be November. Um, also, yesterday I was in the lab and raking through um, boxes and stuff. There's there's a lot of boxes that are still there from I, I've not opened them since I moved from the old lab and um, it's just been so busy. So Raking through those boxes yesterday. I found some products that uh, Like old stock maybe one of Say like one of um, certain hats and that kind of thing. I might try and film them today to show you what I'm talking about and um, so I'm thinking of putting a wee section on the website at some point and um, it's like Odds, oddities and rarities, that kind of thing. Because there's a couple of misprints there as well, which are quite cool, quite unique. Um, and I know somebody in the Brotherhood would want to get them. So instead of me hanging on to them, they'll just sit on a shelf. I thought it would be cool if somebody else has them. So, yeah, I'll show you them later on. I'm still undecided what to do with them, but I think I might put a wee section on the website that's you know, oddity, oddities and rarities, that kind of thing. Um, and then any so stock I find that's old stock will go in there. Um, but obviously I'll announce that properly before I do it. Um, right, I think that's it. I think that's it. Oh, moustache combs. I found while I was doing that yesterday, I found five moustache combs as well. So there's five moustache combs back in stock. At the time of recording this, there's five moustache combs on the website. If anybody's looking for one, yeah, I know there's a few people looking for them. So they're on the website now. Um, there are new ones in production, but that might be another month or so before they're here. So, uh, so yeah, they're there. Right, I am going to go this time, head into the lab, get orders done, and I will see you in a little bit. See ya. I posted this on Instagram earlier, right, but this still blows my mind. Flat out t-shirt, Fred Durst wearing it on stage with Limp Biscuit. Flat out t-shirt, Fred Durst wearing it on stage in Glasgow at the O2 Academy, 16th of February in 2014. That's mad. Alright, where to start, where to start. So, these are items that have been released in the past and uh, these are extras that I had or misprints. So... I'm kind of going to show you these, and um, I, I genuinely don't know the best way to do this, man. Because I'm going to, I want to put like a, like I mentioned earlier, an oddities or rarities part on the the website. I don't know when I'm going to do it. Um, first things first, man. If you see something you want, send me a message, and I'll I'll see if we can sort it out right before I do that thing on the website, right? So, first up. Um, I got these, I found these, these are old badges that I got done years ago, 2015, 2014, something like that. So, they're available. And then the original beer mats I got done, I got these done for the Isle of Man TT. Obviously that discount code does not work anymore, but they're pretty cool, they're pretty cool. A couple of different photos in there. Um, I've just dropped them on the floor, but they are fine. Um, and then I got this white winter beanie. I think, again, I think that was 2016 that came out. Same with that one, black version. This hat, I have no idea, 2016, 17, something like that. Um, it's not a, I mean, so it's got the full coverage at the back. And I've got the trucker one, the grey one, it's mesh at the back. Uh, these are the, the originals of the new hat uh, style. I used to do, there was a style I've done before, but um, they're long gone, but these are like when I first started designing them myself and got you know our own branding inside and things. Um, this was the very first one I got done, so it's got Brotherhood on the side, the logo on the front there. So there's two of them available. All right, so we've got these, these were the mystery t shirts. Uh, it's Brotherhood, so around over four, uh, three lines. 
This one is a large, and I've got this one. This was a mystery t-shirt as well, and that's a large as well. I've got this one, the original. This is the original bra t-shirt um, for, for, stubble, for stubble to skiff and rubble there. It's got the same on the back for stubble, stubble to skiff and rubble on the back as well. That's hard to see. Anyway, this is a medium. Um, we have got the inked t-shirt. I can't remember when this came out. It's got a slight print defect there, but it's absolutely nothing. You can never tell. Yeah, that's a triple XL, and then we've got this one, the Brotherhood one, which is a XL. And then this, uh, I actually done this for Lewis Rollo back in, I don't know, 2014. Um, I got a, a stack of these made for him um, and his team, and this is one I've got left over. So this is a small, it's a small hoodie. Um, it's the only blue merch you will see of Bra Beard Oil, because I think Lewis's stuff is probably done now, it's probably been binned or used for rags for cleaning up oil now, that was a long time ago. So, this is probably the only one in existence of this, it's a small, um, so yeah that's kind of what I've got. Also, there is this, uh, this would be in the Oddities collection, because it's printed upside down. <laughs> but it's one of the things, it's like if it doesn't sell I'll keep it for the museum, because I have a lot of cool stuff uh, that's broad related. And then there's this one as well, it's been printed in reverse for some reason, I don't know why. Um, again, there's only one of these, there's only one of these out there. Um, if somebody wants them, well, I'd like they'll be available for sale. If not, I'll stick them in the museum with the rest of the cool stuff. Anyway, that's it. So um, if you see anything you like, send me an email actually. Send me an email at this address here. Send me an email there, address there. And it's first come, first serve, man. If you see something you like, take a screenshot of it, send me it at that email address and uh, I'll, I'll sort it out for you. Hello, that is Friday done. It's been a manic week, it's been busy, so thank you very much for your support. There was a whole, about 100 and, oh, I don't know, there was 107 orders, I said, that came in on in one day, and then there was more came in throughout that day, so Monday was busy, Tuesday was busy with orders, which is insane, it's amazing. Thank you very much for your support. Wednesday, uh, trying to get the Halloween stuff done, as well as orders and customer review of the week. Um, Halloween stuff, I'm going to redo it next week at some point. It's the photos were okay, but I, I can make them better, so that's what I'm going to do. And I'm still waiting on one thing to come, so it's better just fo like photographing them all together. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, it's cool. We got the shout out from Jesse from Kill Switch Engage. That was <laughs> very very cool. So that's on all the social media channels now. And then the rarities and oddities stuff. Um, found that yesterday, and I, I, you've just seen it. So. Like I said, if you want anything, email me at that address that I mentioned and uh, I'll send you a link and stuff and I can sort it out. But as I say, it's first come, first serve. Um, I think that is it. I think that is it. Uh, this weekend, family time, uh, meeting some friends as well that I've not seen for a long time, which I'm looking forward to. And then back at it next week. Um, it's going to be a busy one next week as well. Um, working on a few things. I've got a list of stuff there. I've got a list of stuff there. Um... Yeah, so much to do, so much to do. It's all good, it's all good. The brand's growing, getting more popular, which I'm really loving, I'm enjoying. Um, my goal at some point would be to employ somebody, you know, offer somebody a job and help out that kind of way, um, which I'm kind of working towards. So we'll see, we'll see how it goes. Right, I am going to go. Thanks for watching, I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up below. Uh, yeah, thumbs up below. Leave a comment if you'd like to, I'll get back to you when I can. And share this video with anyone you think may like it. Um, anyway, with that said, stay safe, look after yourself, and I will see you all next week. Catch you later.